Jason Franchuk from the Daily Herald, CougarBlue.com, here at the Spectrum in Logan on Friday night where BYU starts its season with a 69-62 loss to the Aggies. This is an awfully tough place to play, just like the Marriott Center in Provo, and BYU will be haunted at least for a few days by a six-minute stretch when it could not score. BYU took a 42-38 lead with about 11 minutes left. Brandon Davies hit a couple free throws. Things were looking good for the Cougars, but they went the next six minutes without scoring. There were six missed shots, three turnovers, a couple fouls. Utah State got going. The crowd got going. This sold-out environment of 12,000 people, 4,000 students. They were rocking here in the yellow and orange seats that are behind me. And BYU again 0-1 on the year. Noah Hartsock had 18 points. The experienced guys fought through foul trouble in the first half. Played pretty strong in the second half. Charles Abuo had 16 points. Brandon Davies, the junior center in his return, 13 points on 4-10 shooting. He took an awful lot of heckling here in the spectrum. Uh, some a little bit dirtier than others, but he played through it. Uh, BYU again 0-1. They will go back home, play at the Marriott Center, the friendly confines, on Tuesday night against a team that they kind of know pretty well. BYU Hawaii is in town. That's part of a four-game tournament that will eventually take the Cougars to Chicago where they'll play Nevada and possibly a very good team in Wisconsin out in the Windy City. I'm Jason Franchuk. Thanks for tuning in. Enjoy your uh, weekend. Richard Teasdale, give them what they want.